pass by with your amazing smile. And every time you go, you can see in my eyes I'm not the same. Good afternoon, I am Johnson Damian, instructor from the Department of Geography. And this afternoon, we will briefly discuss, well, what is uh, geography? So, ano nga ba ang geografiya? So, kung simulan na ako sa isang anecdote, well, siguro ang experience nyo na ito, uh, pag meron kayong high school reunion, round table discussion, tatanungin ka nila, okay, anong course mo sa college? And, ikot yung discussion, then dadating sa'yo. And, in a way, that troubles me because why? Pag sinabi mo, uh, for example, mechanical engineering, or dealing with forces, energy, Pag sinabi mo political science, well, you deal with politics, power relations. Pero pagdating sa'yo, anong ginagawa sa geography? So, it's difficult to answer and it gets worse. So, for example, geography tatanong nila. So, geography ka pala, so ano ang capital ng ganitong country and this and that? So, it gets worse. Anong ginagawa sa geography? So, let's enlighten ourselves within the next couple of minutes or so. Ano nga ba ang geography? So, geography is a discipline. Uh, I can talk here all day and uh, still hindi natin matatapos yung definition ng job. But to put it simply, geography is the science of, well, understanding the relationships between humans and their environment. And most importantly, it's understanding where, where this uh, particular human and uh, environmental uh, phenomena are and why are they there. To put it simply, geography answers the question of where are things, why are they there, and how did they get there. So to give you an idea, geography has two main branches. It's physical and human geography. So to make it, uh, to make a point here, kung titingnan natin, it's one of the Bachelor of Science courses here in CSSP. So why? Because it uses environmental sciences and techniques from the social sciences as well. So it's the meeting, so it's the marriage in a way of the physical and the social sciences. So ano bang Ano ba ang kinalaman ng geografiya sa ating pang araw-araw na buhay? So, as all other disciplines are, it is a way of life. So, it tackles simple things such as, well, for example, distance and location. So, in physics and in math, well, distances are measured in millimeters, kilometers, and so on. But in the social sciences, distance has many forms. And it's one more concept in geography. For example, well, Palma uh, Hall, this building is just close to Vincent's, but then, Okay, if it's a rainy day and you got injured the day before or wala kang pamasahe, it gets far. So it's, it takes into account how distances, how locations, or how our perceptions of places change depending on who you are. Sabi nga sa ibang disiplina, we take things not for what they really are, but for who we are as people. So it's the merging of the physical environment to human environment. And right now, nasan ba tayo? We're here in the GIS lab the Geographic Information Systems Laboratory at the Department. So it's making technology, computer technology nowadays, and information technology meet the discipline as a social science. So here we have students here now who are working on their field output. So they're working on, uh, let's say, risk assessment, disaster assessment. So it's one of the many applications of geography. And as far as I'm, I'm concerned, there's so much more to tell, but then I hope that's enough. In a nutshell, that's what geography is about where things are, why are they there, and how did they get there. So thank you.